So if you've been searching for a new airbrush to buy, then I'm sure that you've come across a name called Gallery. In this video, I'm going to be taking a look at their Mobius 0.3mm airbrush. Let's get into it and see how it performs right now. So this is the Mobius 0.3mm. What I'm going to do is just take the shrink wrap off and then I can show you what you get inside. So the box definitely looks impressive, feels like decent quality and just a little bit of info. So this is the 0.3 Mobius Unique Tangent Micro Air Channel Nozzle for superior low pressure atomization, mirror level removable cup for effortless cleaning, lightweight and ergonomic design, main lever with adjustable tension. And you can see it's got the uh, rear of the handle highlighted with that unusual twisted design which I'm eager to try and you can see that this airbrush is made in China. So let's go ahead and see what's inside and you have the exploded diagram here on the inside of the box I think that's a really good idea. Little note to customer with some of their social media links. Quick start guide so this will show you some troubleshooting as well as basic airbrush usage, cleaning and maintenance and they give you some extra o-rings and bits and pieces which is good just in case they wear out you get a tube of lube much like the Awadas now personally I don't use lube but if you do wish to use it just one drop behind the trigger and one on your needle but if you keep your airbrush clean enough generally you don't need to use this and the airbrush you can see this is the 0.3 trigger feels nice got that sloped square sort of design on the trigger I like the gold accents that they've got on the airbrush and you can also see that twisted handle design. It also comes already fitted with a male quick connect so that's handy. You can see that you don't have the colour cup fitted so it just screws on. It's nice having that option to just screw the cup on. You also get these rubber protector caps, they're handy. I use them all the time and if you take your air cap off you'll see the 0.3 mil needle and apart from the nozzle size you can see that the 0.2 mil has a much smaller color cup of 0.067 fluid ounces which is about 2 mil whereas the 0.3 mil has a color cup size of 1 third ounces which is approximately 9.85 mil you can see that mirror image on the cup as well which gallery says that it makes it easier to clean. Not 100% sure if it does or doesn't. Now the other main difference with the 0.3 versus the 0.2 is you don't have the MAC valve. Okay, so test out the 0.3 version of the Mobius. I like to remove the air cap where I can easily manage tip drying and I also find it's easier to get fine lines because you've got a direct line of sight. It's gonna add in some Trident Blue to the color cup. Now I'm spraying at about 25 PSI. So again feels nice and smooth. To fast track your learning you can definitely check out our online airbrushing course at airbrushasylum.thinkific.com Seems to be fairly easy to pull a fine line. The trigger's comfortable. Feels a little bit like the trigger on a, a wider micron. So these were some fine lines and dots that I did with the 0.2 Mobius. So let me see how the 0.3 stacks up against that. Obviously without a MAC valve, just pulling back a little bit. There's a bit of a delay with the paint coming out, only slightly. Went up a bit too close there and hit my needle. So just be careful of that if you're gonna take the air cap off. You can see the 0.3 can handle the fine detail just as well as the 0.2. Again, this is just straight out of the box. I mean, I haven't worn these in at all. I'm hoping that after a bit of use, they're gonna get better as they go on. Definitely feels smooth. The twist in the handle is a nice feature, looks really cool. Feels comfortable. 
but I think I really need to put these brushes to the test over a long period and just put some airbrushing hours on them see how they really perform when I'm creating some artwork so I think that'll be the best way to see if these will last after sort of six to twelve months will they still be performing like this or are they just gonna deteriorate after some time that's the only concern I have out of the box you know just using it now it definitely feels nice and smooth and you could do pretty much all of your airbrushing with one no problem at all but I think I just need to spend a bit more time to really give 100% accurate feedback